Welcome to the Zedco Bot Channel. For the last few weeks, we've been trying out this reconfiguration of our 24 volt battery bank. This diagram shows here that we found at solarhomestead.com. We also installed a positive and negative bus bar. And since we installed it, there's two things I noticed, um, nothing major. Um, the first thing, you could check your voltage at the battery bank and it would be say 25.4. Then you would go inside and look at, at the Outback Mate and it would say 25.2. Uh, it's now reading the same at the battery bank as it is at the Outback Mate. And the other thing that I noticed since we've been testing this out is the voltage would go up to up around 27 volts uh, quicker than it used to on bulk charging. So now we got our new L16 batteries. Our new batteries are three. 185 and powers compared to the old ones 225 and powers which uh, before we were at 675 amp hours now we're at 1155 amp hours we got them s switched out And the other thing we've done is added a 12 volt battery vent fan. It's a two inch conduit pipe that we've run out um, and wired. I ran 14 gauge wires to the auxiliary one inputs on the Outback inverter and I've got it set up to cut on when we're charging up over about 26.4 volts and just got it running continuous while we're charging. It gets really hot down here on the south facing porch where these batteries are and I just wanted to remove some of that stagnant air in there in the summer times when it's really hot while we're upgrading the battery bank this year. I figured it'd be a good time to install it. It's later in the day. It's about 6.30 in the evening and I don't have time to show a hydrometer test of all these batteries, but I just did a quick check here and all the batteries checked at the same voltage. Uh, I think it was 6.3. You'll hear say it over and over here. But as far as I can tell, this is uh, working out good. We'll let you know if it does anything otherwise. 6.3 It's probably 6.3 6.3 <laughs> See you next time.